So now that we know how to extend a template, it's time to show you how you can change specific things in that inherited um, inherited templates, in inherited template or file. So now that we have the complete code, the complete index that HTML provided to us here in the simple, the question is what if we want to change the content? Because we obviously we just we don't just want to copy the complete code and return the same exact code to the user if the user goes to the simple that HTML. Of course we want to change a few things. We we need obviously to change the content. But how can we do that? Well we can do that by using what's called blocks. So we we basically what we are gonna do here is that I'm gonna inject a code here in this body and instead of this uh, H1 you can inject your code and therefore you will have the um, you will have a different page for each single template you have in your uh, in your website. So here, for example, if you want to add a code, uh, different code, if you want to change the code, if you want to change what's going to be returned to the simple that HTML, what we need to do is that here in the index we need to say here uh, curly braces and then percentages and then you need here to create a block. So I'm going to say here block. And then you need to key, you need, you need to give it a you need to give it a name. Let's name it here uh, main content main content. And then here I'm gonna say I'm gonna say I'm gonna end the block. So here I'm gonna say the uh, curly braces and then percentages and then end block. So let me here finish this and then. Let me uh, explain what's going to happen. So what's going to happen is that you can you can inject different HTML code here from this simple that HTML, meaning that you can add a different uh, code, different HTML code in each different template uh, you have, in each different HTML file you have, instead of returning the same exact uh, same exact code, same exact HTML code, and that can be done here by uh, by injecting the code. So here what we need to do is that we need to create a block block and then you need to give it the same exact uh, name as as the main block uh, as the main content here. So here it must be named main content main content and then here it must say curly braces and then percentages and then end block and between these between uh, these lines goes your code. So for example here if you want to return uh, h1 and then here you can uh, you can here say simple this is this is the simple page simple page what's gonna happen is that it's going to copy this code and inject it here in this in this block in the uh, index.html let me save and show you that. So if you save everything and if you head on over back to the browser and refresh, guess what? What's going to happen is that it's going to return the uh, index page, but it's going to add to it. It's going to add to it this h1 tag because what I did is that I here said I first here extended the index and then I injected a new code. I injected a new code to this HTML uh, index.html. So this is how it works. This is how you can inject a code, a specific code, from from the uh, from a file from a file to its uh, kind of its parent, and therefore you are gonna get a new different page. And I'm gonna show you the uh, how how awesome this and how useful this uh, later as we uh, will have a different uh, a few different pages.